Well, hello everyone. This is Dr. Shelley Plum. I am on location at the Palm Beach Film Festival, and I am here today with two wonderful gentlemen, and they have uh, directed and produced a wonderful movie. And uh, can you introduce yourself? Yes, uh, <clears throat> my name is Vindana. I am Kalpana. Wonderful. And can you tell our viewers out there what the name of your magnificent movie is? Yeah, it's called Dirty Yellow Darkness. Wonderful. And, you know, for those of us out there that don't really know what the movie is about, can, can you give us a, maybe a summary? Uh, sure, yeah. Right. Yes, uh, it's a movie based on a true story. And it's about a young professional, successful professional who suffer from a severe case of obsessive compulsive disorder. He, he's afraid that his own urine contaminates everything around him. So, <clears throat> unable to put up with his uh, idiosyncrasies and his eccentric behavior, his wife leaves him. <clears throat> so he admits himself to a mental hospital in order to get better and win his wife back. In a society where it's, uh, where it's a stigma attached to it heavily to mental patients, mental hospital and mental health. That's incredible. What, a, what a, uh, a, an interesting premise behind the movie. Very unique. And I know you were telling me something unique about how you um, dealt with the actors, where you brought them to give them the experience so that they could really feel the characters they were playing. Can you share? Uh, yes. Actually, uh, once we uh, finalized the cast, uh, we did uh, w uh, several workshops uh, with the mental hospital. Uh, and also we arrange them to go spend time with the real patients so they can get to know their character because we want them to be very authentic uh, to the character. Uh, yeah, because the outside world, the people's perception of mental patients is quite contradictory from what they actually are. So uh, to keep the authenticity and to be genuine and be truthful to the original story, so we made them uh, associate those and get familiar with those conditions and to see, observe them, study them, and so they can actually portray what, what they're like. I can only imagine doing that because not a lot of filmmakers, I don't think, do that. And that makes the, the film genuine, doesn't it? it? It makes it very real because they have actually been in the situation. Yeah, yeah, it, it does actually, even the, not just the, the cast who are like portraying patients, but the nurses, hospital staff, everyone was involved in that. And so, we, so that's why the reaction we had from the audiences, because we have been to nine festivals so far, so the reaction was, uh, they were, uh, the one common question was, are these real actors, or are they real patients, or real nurses? And, and, and also we actually uh, use uh, actual staff for several characters, like the, the doctor is actually a doctor, and then the attendant is actually the attendant of the uh, ward. Orderly. Orderly. Orderly and yeah, the yeah. ward head is the actual ward head. ward head. The orderly is the actual orderly in the ward. So we used a lot of non-professional non actors. Non-professional like actors. Can I ask you, is there humor in the film at all? Uh, yes. yes, yes, there is humor, there is humor. But it's not to ridicule the mental patients or anything. It's just there's a very thin, thin line between humor and so you know being ridiculed. So there is humor. Oh, great. It's a very sympathetic humor, not sarcastic or not condescending humor. And also, in a way, it's, a, it's actually a romantic movie. It's a love story. I mean, he's trying to win his wife back because out of the love, he's going... Uh, he's, he's in a society where the mental illness and health and uh, the patients are looked down upon, he is from a middle-class family. He admits himself to a hospital in order to win his wife back out of the name of love. Yeah. The name of love. Yeah. So there's something for everyone, it sounds like, right? And, and I have to ask you one last question, is going through this process, going to the mental hospitals and producing a movie of this type, is there anything that you personally learned? Uh, yes. Well, yeah, go ahead. yeah, I mean, actually, you know, this whole project, it's, uh, the story is actually based on his real life experience. So, I mean, we are we both are the writers and the directors. Directors. We both, I mean, we are brothers. We are brothers. So we, we the elder brother. Uh, yeah, yeah. So I mean, it's a it's a very personal and very important story for our family. Family. So that's why we wanted to share it with the world. Like we wanted to give a positive message to the world about mental health. There is help, and you need to go get help, and then and I mean, yeah, you can get better. Yeah. So. Yeah. So that's the movie is all about giving them hope and a positive message. Positive message. I, I love that. I love that. Well, I thank you both for being with us today. And uh, for those of our viewers that are out there and they are intrigued and want to either read more or watch the film, uh, can you tell them how they can access it? 
Well, actually, yes. uh, it hasn't uh, released online yet, but it will okay. be soon. But okay. we have, uh, I mean, they can follow us on Facebook. Facebook. Uh, it's uh, Premier Nam. Uh, it's our uh, Sri Lankan title, but we have a uh, Gurky, uh, Gurky Yellow Darkness when you website. Search on Google, that Yellow Darkness website, so you can have all the. Uh, Gurky Yellow and Darkness, so you can yeah. uh, follow us. I mean, on the Facebook, and then get information on the website. Yeah. But as soon as it's available, uh, once it get, once it released in Sri Lanka, Sri then Lanka. we'll have it available online. Online. But if there's anyone specially interested, in it, like like a professional or like an industry professional, they can contact us, and we can send them a, 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 link. a secure link. Yeah, we'll be yeah. A link. We can yeah, it is available, yeah. It is available. Yes. Well, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank Good to meet you. Thank you for having us. Having You're us welcome. We would like to thank the Palm Beach International Festival for having us, having giving us, us this opportunity. Welcome. We had a wonderful time and looking forward to be here again. Oh, again. With our okay. next film. <laughs> okay, great, great. Best of luck to you. Okay, bye-bye. Yeah,